Seriously? My bad. Today we are exploring our Houston. Houston? Our Houston. Hey guys, today we are exploring our Houston city passes in the rain, but we're going to do it all while having a whole lot of fun. She didn't bring her jacket. Did you? Maybe wear a sweater. Hattie. What? It's 46 degrees. And rainy. We're, there might be a lot of walking. Well, we're on our way to Houston. Uh, it's about, what, a 45 minute drive? 40, 37 minutes according to this. Yes. So we're not too far away from the big city of Houston. Um, we got a city pass, which they're kind of expensive. Per person is like 60 bucks, and then for kids it's 50 bucks. But when, that gives you access to five locations of five of seven I think it is locations in Houston that are big uh, right. big tourist spots like the NASA Museum the Fine Arts Museum Children's the Museum. Children's Museum the it was a Natural History Museum the zoo like some of them you have to pick either or though. yeah but if you were gonna do it it really kind of looked like if you were gonna do more than one it kind of just made sense to do the whole pass right at least the discount that we got yeah because so. you figure each each one of those places you're gonna go is probably gonna cost you what wow. 30 bucks a piece so if you go and do five of them that's a hundred and fifty dollars yeah. where it's costing us 60 so yeah um, we're gonna try it out there's a lot of stuff we've seen uh, we've been doing a little research on Houston and then there's lots to do so we're gonna head, I think, first it's to... It's like our third day of the monsoon. Yeah, there's there's no beach time. I mean, there could be beach time if you wanna dress like an Eskimo, but the waves are really rolling in and it's been really windy. Yeah, um, hey, Mikey finally fixed our, our issue. Well, I fixed it and then I didn't fix it right. So then I went and fixed it of after how I fixed it. So now it should work. Um, I've got some stuff I want to do to make it better, but the tarp over our slide out was flapping and it felt it like the trailer was going to, it felt like the RV was going to take off. Yeah. So, um, I fixed that, but now we're going to reward ourselves from all that fixing by going somewhere where it's warm. Uh, it's raining in Houston as well. I mean, we're only, what, 30 miles away. So but it's these the are same all weather. indoor activities. Yeah. All the, all the museums <laughs> and stuff, we're not going to be going out on the river walk or anything like that today so um oh. either way we're not going on that because it's too cold today um we're going to do indoor activities and see what we get knocked out we might end up just doing the nasa museum and that's it we figure we'll probably we've got at least another day of rain coming yeah so and we'll the passes are good for nine yeah. from the from the time that you start the first pass you've got nine days to use them all so if you're on a family vacation anywhere near Houston, you know, it should give you plenty of time to go and check out everything that you'd want to. So we're going to go check it out and see what the big deal is about Houston. Houston, we have discovered foreign life, and it is gorgeous. All right, so the first stop on our City Pass tour is the Space Center in Houston. 
uh, home of many Apollo missions. And of course, they've got some really cool things. Uh, one, they've got one of the original space capsules for one of the Apollo missions in there. Uh, all kinds of different spacesuits mm -hmm. from over the years. Hey, there's Chris. Hi. Uh, they have, uh, is it, Addy, is that called a meteorite, a meteoroid, a meteor? Um, palisite. It's, oh, palisite. <laughs> uh, great big rock that fell out of the sky about 10,000 years ago. And it was neat to see that it had survived uh, impact, and it was huge. They said they, they dug it out with a backhoe, but then they couldn't even get it out because it was too big for the backhoe bucket, so they had to lift it out with a special harness. It was kind of neat. And also, it's not just any um, palisite. It's actually an oriented palisite, which means it didn't tumble through the Earth's atmosphere. It just stayed in the same direction. Right. <laughs> she paid a lot more attention than I did. Yes. Um, of course, they've got a tour here, a tram tour, where you actually tour um, uh, one of the, the mission control areas. Um, but it's a tram, and oh, it's raining, and it's cold. And we watched a, the last group of people come in, and they were all soaked and they shivering. They like they were visiting Niagara Falls. Yeah, not, so not, uh... we, we took a pass on the tram. Uh, but we got some cool shots, uh, got to see a lot of neat things, um, how they're preparing for missions to Mars, and um, just how far the, the space program has come. It was really cool to see a lot of that. So um, now I, I guess we're off and we're going we're, to we're go We're not to, sure. We're going to go check some hours right We're going to check some hours on stuff because it's about, it's almost 3 o'clock uh, Houston time or Texas time. So we're going to see what we might possibly do, see what's open a little later. We've got all kinds of choices. We've got a zoo. Uh, museums. We're going to check it out and we'll let you know just as soon as we know where we're going to go. Houston Children's Museum. Now, we're from close to Indianapolis, and Indianapolis Children's Museum is known to be the best in the country. And you come down here, and this children's museum says that they're the number one children's museum. So we're gonna see how it stands up. Hey, we gotta go catch up with Addie. She's oh yeah, she's... That's why the cops next door so they can charge me. <laughs> I think so. Look, I painted a Van Gogh. Experiments and science. 
there's science, there's culture, there's, there's art. fitness, there's art, there's music. Math, all kinds of like real life skill stuff. I really think it's really cool. And, and Addie, we haven't been able to keep her um, with us. She's, she's always having a ball, summer, yeah. literally. literally. She's got yeah. balls over there. We've enjoyed it. Houston, you have a fantastic children's museum. Yes. It is definitely one of the best we've ever been to. Yes. So, well, I think it's time to go get some dinner. Yes. So we were looking for a place to eat when we got out of the children's museum. That place looks good. I bet it does. Aww. <laughs>